tonight on Bondi Rescue. A playground one minute, disaster zone the next. They could have died. Do you understand? Yeah, yeah. Lifeguards race to an unconscious woman. I've never heard of this trogan, I don't know anything about it. Blake's training drill turns very serious. And David and Goliath. Maxie goes head to head with a very angry surfer. Let's just see how tough you are. They will see how tough you are. Take me back to the sweet times. to one of the world's great fun parks. There's thrills galore for young and old, big and small. And best of all, ladies and gentlemen, admission is free. Why can't we just sing of happy things? But a warning to all parents, this fun park has a very dangerous side. This is probably the... Um worst environment to have kids. I mean, you know, it becomes a bit of an issue for us some days. It, we become like a mining centre. Yeah, I guess they get a little bit excited, the kids, when they're around the water and they don't think, you know, they love it. But it quite often leads to, leads to trouble. Attention everyone on the beach, the conditions are very dangerous today. We've got small children. It's advised by the lifeguards to stay as close as you can to the children. On a sunny Sunday, families flock to Bondi's North End, usually the safest part of the beach. But today, there's a dangerous rip. Many children aren't even aware what a rip is. Lifeguards know the danger, even if some kids and parents don't. Suddenly, a child screams for help. Kyle races in, then Tom. Two girls are drowning. Kyle grabs both. But then, there's a third girl in trouble. Tom rescues her as Quiggers helps Kyle with the first two. Three girls have nearly drowned and not a parent to be seen. <laughs> Unbelievable. You can probably see there's a rescue going on right now. It's not very safe to swim. If you want to swim, walk up to the red and yellow flag. Mate, we're just kind of kicking back thinking it's OK, but bang. You know, this went so quickly. At least now, they're screaming with delight. <laughs> Dino decides it's time for a serious lecture. Parents are going to get a rev up. Okay, come here. Where, where's your mum? Come here. No, I'm well done, boy. Where are you from? Girls, where are you from? Korea. Korea. Scary. I don't know where they came from, but they shouldn't have been out there. She was scared. She was screaming. She was really scared. Then our three lost kids. Keep going, mate. You'll find him soon. Excuse me. Hello. Yeah. How are you? How are you? Good. Do you know your three girls almost just died then? Yeah. And they had to be rescued by lifeguards? Yeah. How come you're not watching them? What's 
그런 보트요. 그 개나 태워갖고요. 우리 구해서 이렇게 온 거예요. 아, 예. Yeah. When your girls are in the water, yeah. you must watch them. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And they must swim yeah. where the red and yellow flags are. Yeah. They could have died. Yeah. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We've had people die here. Uh, Imagine only having two uh, daughters. Yeah, yeah. Two daughters? Well, you one, one. Ah, uh, yeah. Very sad. Yeah. Horrible. Yeah, I understand. Well done, Dino. Message received loud and clear. No, kind of. It wasn't long ago that Bondi's youngest trainee lifeguard was just another kid on the beach. At 16 and just out of school, Maxie's had to grow up fast. He's rescued drowning swimmers, treated spinal injuries, chased thieves and comforted lost children. But something says Maxie is still a kid at heart. How does it go, Maxie? Today, the old guard have decided it's time for Maxie to grow up. To test how well a 16-year-old kid copes with a grown-up situation, Terry has recruited a very difficult customer. Bobby Mirovic is three-time Australian heavyweight boxing champion. He's taken on Mike Tyson in the ring. Now, he's about to take on Trent Maxwell on the beach. We've got little Maxie, OK? He's 16, he's our junior trainee. And the whole time he's been with us, it's a bit of uh, sunshine and girls and a good time. I think it's about time that he learnt about the uh, serious side of lifeguarding, and it's not always uh, uh, a really good time at well, beautiful things, Bondi Beach. Things he can't be with the snapper all his life. That's right. Now, last week I spoke about a troublesome board rider, about your dimensions, yeah. OK? And this troublesome board rider gets up the north and he just refuses to leave the water. Yeah. So Maxie's going to try his best to move the whole 130 kgs of you out of the water and off the beach. Just like fishing, we'll play with the fish, let him go, give him a bit of slack, pull him back in when we need to, yeah. and then we'll finish him off. <laughs> bring, it, bring it on! No, yeah. 